most of us think that it's always got to be behind the pulpit and it's always got to be in words but sometimes your life your life is a testimony the way you live your life before people the way um you go out and tell others you know um sometimes you you don't have to talk but sometimes you show it Somebody see the blessings in your life. What's up my love bugs and love mamas? This is Mama Love and I am back with another video. And I'm not sure if I'm holding this camera correctly because I don't have my tripod in my hand. I'm holding the camera with my finger and I'm not sure if my finger is on the speaker. So I'm gonna turn it off and I'm gonna come back on. Okay, so my hand wasn't over the speaker. I have a video for you all today. It is a high protein, salad and I'm making it with eggs and pan seared salmon for the first time I'm pan searing some salmon uh, I've never did it before but I'm trying it out and um, I'll add some little eggs to it you know I'm gonna make it all a little spiffy with the little salad dressings and all that type of stuff so stay tuned what's up my love bugs love muffins is mama love I told y'all to stay tuned so I was trying to see. I went up finally, got my lazy tail up, went upstairs and got that tripod, you know. Anyway, so y'all, everybody know that summertime is going to be approaching. We know it's on its way. It's not gonna take long. We know spring gonna hit and they hit from summer. So um um I'm ha I'm not ha really have been doing good at all um on the the eating. I can stand loose, loose, you know what I'm saying? Okay, but I ain't that, I ain't that, uh, that bad. Like, you know, we're like, oh my gosh, she's so fat and obese. You know? It's not like that. I still got curves, you know, stuff like that. But, I am, uh, not going to get on no diet kick with y'all because I'm, I'm tired of stating that and I seem to fail at it. But what I am trying to do is try this salmon salad because the last time I had a salmon salad y'all was in um, Georgia and they got a good one at Cheddar's and they got a good one at uh, the Cheesecake Factory so I'm gonna make my own I'm gonna make my own last time I broiled it and squeezed some onions on it I think not onions but lemons and y'all saw me in a video make some salmon along with those uh, salmon croquette patties so this is what I'm doing right here uh, before you I have um, I boiled two eggs, which I'm gonna cut up, and I'm gonna slice these up a little more, a little cheese, and I got a bit of a spring mix organic lettuce. But over here, I am. This is the ingredients here. I got two pieces of salmon. Yes, y'all. I ain't the type of person that one piece nothing. I gotta have two pieces. I'm keeping it real. Don't give me no one piece. Like if I eat catfish, I gotta have two pieces. You know. Anyway, so this is something that I had bought at Walmart. It's by McCormick. It's one sheet pan glazed salmon uh, mix. And it's got garlic and I see sav miso. Don't, don't give me the trying to spell that word or say that word. But anyway, I'm supposed to put this um, in a pan with vegetables. And I'm supposed to add water and the seasoning and brown sugar. Of course, and this, the salmon. And, um, but I'm not going to do it that way. I'm going to, um, actually take this meat is already washed off and I'm actually going to take this and I'm going to make it like a seasoning and I'm going to season it on each side after I rub it in real good. I'm do it like this y'all. You know, it's my first time trying this. So don't beat me over the head. Tell me about something. What is you doing? Girl, what is you doing? See, I'm just a little, get a little seasoning or whatever on both sides of it. And uh, I don't know about adding no brown sugar. Because, uh, eh, I don't know. I might so I'll get it in the pan and see how it fries uh, with a little um, olive oil. Or maybe, maybe step some of that. I can't believe it's not butter. But, eh, I stick with the olive oil because I want a little olive oil. And so I'm smearing it in. I gotta always say this with my clean hands and that am I gonna put any more seasoning on that no I'm not that is fine just the way it is okay so then I'm going to bring it over here to the stove and I'm going to pan sear it okay so I just got a 
two teaspoons of olive oil and I'm just going to place this on two pieces of meat of salmon in there and uh, I'm going to let it cook for maybe about I don't know six minutes on each side I'm not sure I got to play it by sight okay and as I'm doing that I'm going to come over here and I'm just going to slice my eggs up like three ways and then slice those tomatoes down some and uh you know make that become life and we're gonna use a um what i'm gonna use on the dressing part um i think i may put a brown sugar spread over over the um salmon because of the fact that i have uh olive oil and vinegar um, so this olive oil and vinegar is good on salads does not have a type of sweet to it though You know how you want that um Vinaigrette Sweet type of vinaigrette sauce and the only way that I can make that and and think that uh, a best way I can do that is to um Add brown sugar Add brown sugar on the salmon and that way it'll give it like a little sweet Taste, you know, just Slightly sweet taste as well as if I added some cranberries or something like that. That's the type of taste that I want it to have so um, Stay tuned So I know I said six minutes on each side, but I just went over and turned it over within like two Two minutes or something like that because I wanted to see how it's looking because like I said y'all This is my first time ever ever making something like this um, and I know salmon does not take that long to uh, prepare you know see it browning you know you don't want it gummy either you don't want it like a uh, rubber so I don't want to really you know fry it that much which is on medium heat you all um, with the seasoning only I have not added the brown sugar yet okay so I've already went and turned this over on the other side as you can see it's cooking uh, quite well what I went and did was I went and added two teaspoons of um, brown sugar and then I added water to it because I just want it like to liquefy it and um, what I want to do is I want to go ahead and pour it over hope this turns out right you all like I said this is my first time this is how it's looking I actually I, I feel like this is finished I don't want to like I said do too much it does not take that long for salmon to, to, to uh, prepare salmon and I know that much by the salmon patty. You know, it don't take that much. I'm going to for that. Okay. And that's how it looks on that side. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn this down on low. And I'm going to go ahead and add the brown sugar glaze that I tried to make. And hopefully, y'all, like I said, this is good. I don't want it to fry uh, too hard, but I do want it to kind of like get a little thick on it. And kind of marinate. That's what I wanted to do. Marinate. Looks good so far. You know I'm gonna be honest with y'all. <laughs> hey, y'all remember that shrimp fried rice? It was looking all good and stuff. And I turned around and <laughs> it tasted terrible because I used all that soy sauce. I was supposed to repeat that uh, shrimp fried rice, but I never got around to it. So hey, you know, this is how it go. Okay. So this is what I did. I went on ahead and cut up my eggs and what I'm going to add to this salad you all and just um, make it pretty like the restaurant type of thing and add my tomatoes I cut up let me just go ahead and quit playing there there we go quit playing Reba Spread my cheese around and I got my eggs and my tomatoes. I could have cut up onions and stuff like that. I didn't uh, My main focus is on how the salmon tastes and I didn't want to have too many um, Ingredients or condiments or well, not condiments, but vegetables taken away from it y'all this this is so good um, I tried a little piece y'all Already and I'm gonna take this That's how the salmon look done 
glaze. It's got a sweet, savory glaze to it. Well, I'm telling y'all, this is so good, okay? I kid y'all not. Now, y'all know I kept it real about the, uh, that shrimp fried rice. That's why I'm saying it. Look at that. That's a salmon salad. My olive oil and vinegar. I'm going to pour it a little over it. Just this. Shout out to real big old mo. Olive oil and vinegar. And like I said, with the sweet kick over the salmon uh, with the brown sugar where it was glazed on there, that was the perfect way I could have ever did it. Um, I wouldn't do it no other way. Uh, from now on, I'm cooking it that way instead of broiling it in a pan with a lemon. I'm going to sear it on the stove with the... Um, Y'all, this is a... It's one sheet pan glaze, glazed salmon with vegetables. As you know, y'all saw me. I did it a different way. I just used the seasoning at the top. I waited till it got done on each side. And then I went in with the uh, brown sugar water to make like a glaze. And when I poured it on there, y'all, it got thicker. Um, the sauce. It turned into like a little glaze sauce. And it got thicker. And this is what it turned out to be. And I just think this salad is so pretty. Okay, y'all. So this is my salmon salad that I would normally go sit down when I was in Georgia and have it Cheddar's restaurant and um, or uh, Cheesecake Factory. You put a piece of salmon, some egg, a tomato, all that's going in my mouth. Mmm, it's so good. I'm so, I'm proud of myself. Y'all, this salad is good. And as good as it looks. This is a good salad, you. Oh my good. I wish I would go to a restaurant and pay for another salmon salad and I made it like this. Shut your mouth. Where my lemon water at? Okay. I'm at a restaurant, okay? Reba's restaurant. Oh, this is so good. Troy, you want to try a piece of this fish? Mmm. Um, y'all, the summer coming and... I want you to get that part, baby. Because that's why I put that glaze on it. As I know, I keep it real. I always battle my weight. One day, one day, what you say? What's that? What you say? I heard that. Mm. Y'all heard that? Mm. He said, that's good. One day, I I'm going to get there. I ain't going to stop. If I could eat like this, though, you know, my, my thing is, y'all, I love uh, pastas and breads. I'm addicted. I'm just addicted to them. So. But if I can eat like this, I'll be a healthy person and I'll be a much happier person. Oh, this is so good. Is my phone ringing? It shouldn't be. And then this egg, y'all, is just a protein, you know? This is a healthy salad. So you can have that. So remember, olive oil and vinegar dressing. And when you want that little kick to it, the little brown sugar paste I made. Or whatever. And whatever choice you want. Type of lettuce. or You can use uh, spinach or whatever. But um, pan seared uh, salmon is all of that. To me, it's better than broiled. <clears throat> I've never tried it grilled before. But um, I like the pan seared. Not, I'm not sure it's the way the restaurant did it. But... Um, it tastes like Applebee's, Applebee's uh, salmon. I had it before. I used to go there and have it all the time. When I had left uh, the meat alone, like chicken and sausage and beef and all the other stuff, I was eating just fish and shrimp. And I felt good eating like that, you know, for two, I think it was two months I made it. And uh, yeah, so try this recipe. I hope that you enjoyed this video. Peace out in Jesus' name. Be blessed. I'm about to smash on this salad because I was just being nice in front of y'all. I'm about to dig in. All right.